Alright guys, so the audio did get cut a little off on this one and it was just it didn't it didn't flow right, so I just got rid of it. Uh, right now this is the nuketown for the Black Ops 3 Easter egg. Uh it's the same thing as the Black Ops 2 Easter egg. You still have to shoot the mannequin heads off in two minutes or less. Um there's only one catch, it's no longer the eight bit game on the sign, which you can see right here. But it is it's something totally different. Um, it shocked me once I did this. I didn't expect it to be this. It's kind of cool though. I really don't want to spoil it for you, so I'm just going to let you sit here and watch it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you in the next one. Alright guys, and as you can see, it is zombies. We had this in Black Ops 2, the actual zombies, and now we have it in Black Ops 3 as a just little, a little thing in the multiplayer. Uh, I'm not so sure if you can do this in a public match. It, it'd be something fun trying to do. <laughs> it would screw with everybody that's actually playing. Um, it works the same thing as Black Ops 3 zombies. There, it takes three hits for you to die. Um, the guns do about the same amount of damage as a non-pack of hunters version of that gun would do. Alright guys, as I did say, some of the audio got cut off along with some of the video, but it works the same way as regular zombies. You can just keep training them in a circle, or walking around the entire map if you choose to, but they will eventually stop spawning. Once you start killing them, they'll start spawning in again. It's a never-ending spawn of zombies, which is actually really cool. Um, I did try with my special. It should be at the end of the video. This should be a couple shots of me using it. 
but it's just like a multiplayer. It one hits them if you hit them. Uh, explosive damage does about the normal explosive damage as it would on a zombie, and or what it would do to a normal person in multiplayer. Uh, thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll talk to you later.